In a small town nestled between rolling hills and winding rivers, there lived a young boy named Georgie. Georgie was a curious soul, always seeking adventures beyond the confines of his ordinary life. However, as fate would have it, his days were often spent in monotony, trapped within the mundane routines of school and chores. One particularly sweltering summer day, as the sun beat down mercilessly upon the town, Georgie found himself overcome by a relentless wave of boredom. With no friends to play with and nothing but the repetitive drone of cicadas to keep him company, he felt as if the entire world had conspired against him. Sighing heavily, Georgie kicked at the dirt beneath his worn-out sneakers and wandered aimlessly through the streets. His mind wandered to distant lands filled with towering mountains and endless oceans, longing for the kind of excitement that seemed forever out of reach. As he trudged along, a glimmer of hope flickered in Georgie's eyes when he spotted a faded poster pinned to a weathered bulletin board. It announced the annual town fair, promising games, rides, and entertainment for all. Suddenly. A surge of anticipation coursed through his veins, and he knew that this was his chance to break free from the chains of boredom that had held him captive for far too long. With newfound determination, Georgie raced home, his heart pounding with excitement. He dashed through the door, barely pausing to catch his breath before blurting out the news to his parents. To his delight, they agreed to accompany him to the fair, eager to see the spark of joy reignited in their son's eyes. As the day of the fair dawned, Georgie could hardly contain his excitement. He practically bounced with anticipation as he and his family made their way to the bustling fairgrounds. The air was alive with the sounds of laughter and music, and the scent of cotton candy wafted temptingly through the air. Georgie wasted no time diving headfirst into the festivities. He tried his luck at every game, determined to win a prize to show off his newfound prowess. With each victory, his confidence soared, and soon he was the proud owner of a colorful array of stuffed animals, much to the amazement of his parents. But it wasn't just the games that captured Georgie's attention. He found himself drawn to the thrill of the rides, the exhilarating sensation of soaring through the air with nothing but the wind at his back. With each twist and turn, he felt the weight of boredom lifting from his shoulders, replaced by a sense of pure joy and freedom. As the day stretched on into evening, Georgie's energy showed no signs of waning. He danced to the lively tunes of the fairground band, his laughter mingling with the cheerful chatter of the crowd. For the first time in what felt like ages, he felt truly alive, his senses ablaze with the excitement of the moment. As the stars began to twinkle overhead, signaling the end of another magical day, Georgie knew that he would carry the memories of this day with him forever. It wasn't just the games and the rides that had made it special, but the sense of connection and belonging he had felt among his fellow townspeople. As he bid farewell to the fairgrounds, his heart full to bursting with happiness, Georgie knew that he would never again let boredom hold him back. For he had learned that sometimes, the greatest adventures could be found right in his own backyard, if only he had the courage to seek them out. And so, with a skip in his step and a smile on his face, Georgie headed home, eager to see what other wonders the world had in store for him. For he knew that as long as he had the spirit of adventure burning bright within him, there would never be a dull moment in his life again. The End Thank you for watching. Like, 